One of the things I wanted to address while we were here in Israel, and we have a wonderful opportunity to do it, is the question of the status of Christians in Israel, because there are some who have uh, expressed concern for us as we travel here this week for our solidarity mission, um, because of a perception by some back in the United States that Christians are not safe. Joining us here uh, in Hostage Square is uh, one of the tour guides who led us in our tour of Israel in 2023. He is a Messianic Jew. Uh, very interesting backstory that we'll get into some other time. We are honored to welcome Ron Silverman. Ron, it's, uh, thank you for joining us here today. Yes. You, perhaps more than most, would be very sensitive to any uh, persecution, if you will, what it's like to be a Christian in Israel. So Israel is a very safe place from Christians and from Messiah. There are issues, there are problems. Like, I think this this is mostly addressed to Jewish people. That yes. Even many Jewish people are afraid of Christians. Right. They're afraid that Christians will take their children and convert them. This is not these Jewish people are very much afraid of that. And and they have a good reason because for knowing the history, Christianity, Many many of the persecutors came from Christianity. Sure, the Middle Ages, Crusades, Inquisition in Spain. So this is uh, for many Jews. This is very sensitive, and this is also a reason why for many Jews it's very difficult to come. Yeah, for sure. We have a very very high obstacle that we need to go. It's not just, past, yeah. It's not just making a decision. It's also then your family feels like you've rejected them as well. It's you know, it's a change of identity. Becoming, building a new identity in Christ is something that is very difficult for you. So with all this, you uh, think the Jewish people in Israel, and this is this has been always, and it's not only in Israel. It's also in America. This is Jewish organizations try to prevent Jewish people from knowing about Christianity. Uh, and that's, it's not, it's not something that the government does. Actually, the government is, is very liberal, I would say. I don't think the government is... There are some people in the government, maybe, that have such an agenda, but it's not something that's wrong. It's not. Christians are very safe here. Uh, Messianic Jews who live here are very safe here. There's no problem. In some communities, in some remote see little cities where they have many ultra orthodox maybe they face some some objection but not not anything that is that we are afraid i mean i don't think we are afraid to say who we are we are not afraid to, to identify as who we are who are the leaders in christ um it's difficult it's difficult for us among the jewish people uh, but it, as I said, it's, it's something much more general and mm -hmm. the lot of history. And I think that history has a lot to do with the supernatural war where the, the enemy, uh, Satan, has wanted to drive that wedge between Christians and Jews. This goes back to the first, especially the second century after the Bar Kokhba rebellion. Uh, once Constantine came into power and Christian, Christianity was legal in the Roman Empire, then it was like, okay, remember back when Bar Kokhba was imprisoning Christians wouldn't fight for him. Now it's time for payback. But then there's 1,800 years of history that's followed that where things have not been good. And I think that's by design of the supernatural enemy of all of us to keep us divided and uh, to this day. But the fact remains that in Israel, Israel is the only country in the Middle East where the population of Christians is growing. That is not the case in the Palestinian Arab territories or in any other Middle Eastern nation where Christians are being driven out and persecuted. Uh, but there is a misperception, I think, by some in the church in the West, in America, that for some reason that Christians are not safe here in Israel. And, uh, so I'm glad you, you could address that. Christians are very safe in Israel. They are not safe in Syria. They are not safe in Iraq. They are not safe in Iran. They are not safe in Egypt. Yes. And, uh, of course, Palestinian Authority, they are not safe there. They are they're running away from there. Anywhere they're not safe in Turkey as, as they used to be. So yeah, Israel is a very safe place for Christians. Probably safe place for Jews in the East. You got a very warm welcome. We've had, we've had very warm welcomes here every time we've been here. Yes. Yeah. Meeting you last year on our tour was one of the high points of our tour. So we're very happy to be back and uh, look forward to coming back again. We can spend more time with you than just this uh, this this brief visit. 
Let's continue.